Hello everyone, my name is Python GB and welcome back to another episode of my Terraria Ranger playthrough. In this episode, ladies and gentlemen, we are going to be starting our journey, hopefully, through the process of taking down the hard mode bosses. So, we're going to be starting off with the destroyer today, ladies and gentlemen. And I have just the tools for the job. We have an unpleasant adamantite repeater. I have equipped my quiver, so straight away we have increased arrow speed and damage. And 20% chance not to consume ammo. Plus another further 25% chance not to consume ammo. So that's 45% chance. That's pretty, pretty damn crazy. Right, the question is, do we have an archery potion? I don't believe we do. Hell oh boy. Would be nice to have one, but at least we have this. Uh, I also went ahead and I took down the Blood Moon. You may remember in the last episode we ended on a Blood Moon, and I didn't really want to go through that with you guys, so, uh, you know. We got these! Presents, ladies and gentlemen. It is the 15th of December at the time of recording this, which I believe is the first day of the Christmas event that normally goes on with Terraria. Obviously, we can have the possibility of a Frost Legion, and also, obviously, the presents. So, without further ado, let's see what we get. Candy cane blocks. Uh, eggnog, okay, interesting, pine tree blocks, and whatever the hell this is. <laughs> oh, no, I've got to see this. i got to see this. What do I look like? What do I look like? Oh, my God. Oh, let me just, let me just take all of my accessories. Well, hang on. There we go. Hide the accessories. Oh, wow, look at me. <laughs> I am dressed to go, my friends. I am dressed to go. Oh, yeah. I'm so happy with this. My god. Okay, so clad in the bottle. Uh, let's take that off. Oh man, this is going to be so cool. <laughs> there, well, let's have the wings visible. Maybe the boots. Uh, nah, we'll have the boots invisible. There we go, buddies. That looks pretty cool, though. I I'm a fan of that. Got ourselves a little vanity set of gear, which is awesome. Pretty sure you can get elf gear from the Frost Moon. Or is that from a Christmas present? I, I actually can't remember, but it doesn't matter too much. But yeah, we have an adamantite repeater. We have Jester's arrows and unholy arrows, which of course pierce through multiple times with the enemy. So if we ever get the destroyer come straight at us head first, then we should be able to do a very, very large amount of damage to him. Because obviously this will just go through all of his sectors and just do a whole bunch of damage, as I was saying. But uh, I require some of these and I also require some water so let me go ahead and go over here and we are going to investigate how we make archery potions because I genuinely have no idea I normally just rely on finding them to be honest with you guys I very rarely make them as you might be able to understand oh there's the guide he did spawn back in good stuff okay right archery potion my god that's a lot of stuff okay oh that's pretty easy day bloom and a lens huh that should be pretty easy. That is Moonglow down there. Do we have any... Do we have any Daybloom? I always feel like Daybloom is something I'm lacking on this world. Oh, no, I actually have two. Nice. Okay. That is very good indeed. Okay. Now, the other thing I need is... Uh, where's it going to be? What kind of chest would it be in? Not in that one. Uh, possibly in one over here? Little, little lenses. Should have some, right? Right? Yeah? Lenses? Oh my god. Oh, there we go. First one. How did I not spot that? Oh my god! You guys are probably shouting at me for doing that. My god. I would not blame you for shouting at me as well. My god, that was bad. It was the first goddamn slot in the bloomin' thing, and I forgot about it. Ah, <sighs> good job, Python. Good job, buddy. So, okay, the next thing we need to do is get some rotten chunks. No, it's vertebrae. Okay, so we need to get vertebrae. Vertebrae! Where you be at, buddy? Yes, mechanical worm. Oh my god, we are so ready for the party. Okay. Uh, I tell you what, let me go ahead and put this stuff in here. I really can't wait for, for 1.3 to come out, because with 1.3, you can do this thing where basically you can favourite things in your inventory, and as a result, if you did deposit all, the favourited things would stay in your inventory. Now, in my opinion, that's very, very cool. Like, that is a very cool addition, and I feel like it would be useful right now. <laughs> Oh my god, but yes, we are pretty much ready to go. What we're going to do very quickly is we're actually going to go ahead... Uh, right, I need to really think about this. So, campfire. Okay, campfire is good. Uh, heart containers. Okay, good stuff, good stuff. Let's grab the iron back out. What we're going to do is we're going to make some chains out of that. Okay, so... Doo -doo -doo. Two of them should be able to make five lanterns straight out. 
Nice amount. That's very cool indeed. Okay, we'll make another campfire. Just we are, just so we have uh, doubled life regen. That should do the job pretty nicely. We are going to make ourselves two stacks of uh, platforms. That should do the job, right? My god, this is going to be larger than I first thought. Good lord. Okay. All the way until we get down to two. Jeez. I did not realise that 99 blocks was this wide. Good lord. Okay. Do, do, do. Do, do, do. Let's keep going, my friends. Oh, look at them. More, more bow tie slimes. That's so cool. Eh, there we go. Okay, and let's just... What the heck? That's so cool. Let's do that. Wood. Lantern. Nice. Let's go over this side do the same. Okay, just so it's sort of evenly spread, I guess. So, lantern. We'll have... We'll just have these directly on top, just because... That's what we can do. There we go. You're out the game. 96 crit damage. God damn, that's a lot. That is a lot. Alright, oh, man. I think I might be good enough to go. I think I should I should be able to do this. I should be able to do this. An iron skin potion might not go go too far. I don't know, it might help us, I guess. I don't know. It might be worth getting. I mean, I guess we have a little bit of time left, which is always good. So let's just keep going. Uh platform there. All the woods. This is why I don't have auto pause on, ladies and gentlemen, because you can have your inventory open and you can just keep going. Whereas if you had auto pause on, then uh, you know you would be able to do this, would you? You would not be able to have your inventory open. The inventory would be well, would freeze the entire game, wouldn't it? So yeah, that's why I don't do it. I know, yes, it adds a bit of a challenge because you know if you go into the inventory, you might die because there might be a swarm of mobs around you. And yes, that can, that I can understand, but. For, I don't know, just for me, I don't like to have auto pause on for the reasons that I like to build while having my inventory open so I can see what I've got in there at all times, if you get what I mean. So, I don't know. It's, it's, it's preference, really, isn't it? It's really preference. So, boom, that goes there. Boom. Boom. Let's make this go down a wee bit. There we go, just so we can actually get in. Alright. I think we are just about ready to go. Look at you! The baby slime! And he's dead. And you're dead as well. <laughs> Lols. Hello. Hi. How are you doing? Hmm. Well, I guess we've got nothing to do but wait now. Ah. Well, that's a refreshing sight. Two blood moons in a row, is it? Well, let me go ahead and make it even worse, shall I? Here we go. Ladies and gentlemen, the destroyer has awoken. And here we go. 76, 75, 74, 73, 72, 71, 70, 69, 60. <laughs> okay. Is this doing slightly better than I first thought? There we go, there we go, there we go. It's a perfect stance. We'll just do this. 55, 53, 50. Uh, th this. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, oh. And health. I'm about to die. Ooh. Need to take out the probes. They could actually kill me. The probes are the things that could actually t take me out of the game. Come on, buddy. I can see the little health things everywhere. Okay, health, health. Oh, I'm actually almost dead. Oh my lord, oh my lord. Oh, I have to be so agile. I could actually die. I'm gonna die, I'm 100% going to die. Oh, come on, that's not what I need, not a wyvern. I've got 15 seconds to try and survive this. I have no choice. Oh, Wyvern, why you do this to me? I don't care. Oh, God, this is not good. Come on, come on. And health. There we go. We are way off course. Ah! Careful. Careful, 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 careful. Just, just, just keep bowing. Just keep bowing. Don't, don't worry, bro. I got this. <laughs> oh, hi. How are you doing? Maybe if I just keep doing this. Maybe maybe I'll just wind up killing some dudes as I go along. Maybe. Destroy. I hear you, but I can't see you. This, this worries me greatly. Ah. Oh, health. 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 Health, health, health. Okay. Good health. Good health. Good health. Oh my god. Okay. I've almost died on multiple occasions. 30,000 health. Man, we did like 20,000 damage of health to him at one point. Like, in such a small amount of time. Here we go, here we go. 
Ooh, okay, we should be able to regen in just a little while, my friends. Oh my god. Oh, hello, little clown. How are you doing, buddy? 15,000 health, ladies and gentlemen. 15k. I am very glad that his damage doesn't increase the further we get along, because otherwise I will be so dead right now, it would be unbelievable. Okay, and health. There we go. That's... How many potions have I used now? Three. Pretty, pretty high amount, let's be honest right here. Oh! <laughs> Absolute carnage! There are so many laser beams floating about that I don't even know... Is this, is this like some sort of techno party? HE'S OUT OF THE GAME! Okay, we're not done yet. Let's get all these little buggers out of the way. Here we go. <clears throat> Come on, buddy. Come on, buddy. Ooh! We ain't done yet! These little probe things can still kill me! Although it's pretty unlikely. Here we go. Here we go. Oh my goodness! I think we got to below 20 health at one point. That's that's pretty crazy. Apparently there's somebody still lasering me. Huh. So who's the guy who's still lasering me? I is confused! <sighs> I don't get it, man. What's what's the Oh, it's because I'm using blooming meteor shots. They're bouncing off. Oh, I'm so dumb. I should have realised that a lot quicker than I did. Good lord. <laughs> oh, man. Ladies and gentlemen, that was the destroyer and he almost killed me. I actually managed to get away. My arena, I feel, wasn't exactly up to scratch right there. But uh, my agility, luckily, was, uh, was my strong point right there. I managed to get away from him at the most sort of opportune time so I could get away from being killed. <laughs> Good lord. That was absolutely crazy. But yes, the uh, repeater did its job. We only have 63 Jester's Arrows left, which is kind of suckish. Would not mind some more. We've got some presents. Hmm, tell you what, we can make this a double whammy. Snow globe. Did we get a snow globe? I don't think we got a snow globe. God dang it. Okay, I wouldn't have minded getting a snow globe because then we could take down the Frost Legion as well. That would have been pretty fun to do. Okay, there's two presents, two chances. Oh, there we go! Oh my god, this is going to be so cool. <laughs> the first seasonal event that I'm doing, ladies and gentlemen. Well, I don't know if you can count the Frost Moon, because you, obviously you can do the Frost Moon at whatever time of the year, really, can't you? Okay. They have arrived! Oh my god! Here they are, here they are. Look at these guys! Look at these! They're so funny, I love them. Oh god! Oh god! They do a lot of damage, they do a lot of damage. Okay, let's go over this way. Hello! Here we go, here we go, here we go, get killed, get killed, get all of you get killed, go on, go on, get, get out, get out, get out, oh, there you go, buddy. <laughs> ah, I love this thing. Obviously, we do have the old uh, unholy arrows as a backup, okay. What should I, should I use this thing? Wow, this thing does a lot of knockback. Obviously, they take a lot of knockback. I mean, they are snowmen, I don't see why they wouldn't take a lot of knockback. I don't know, just my logic, I guess. Hey! Hello! How are you doing, buddies? How are you doing? Ouchie! Please leave me alone, brother! Okay. <laughs> I love the sound they make when they blow up. It, it literally just sounds like a snowball exploding. Ah! Careful! Oh, I think you are getting a bit too ahead of yourself. There we go. I just set another... Well, I just used a bunch of potions again, so we should be good to go for a little while, my friends. And health. There we go. Do they even drop health? Oh yeah, they do drop health. Yeah, you can see there's a bunch of hearts on the ground. Well, the hearts, when the seasonal update is here, even though it's not an update, it's just a seasonal event, I guess, they turn into candy canes. So, you know, that's kind of cool. Oh, I get the difference between them. The Jester's Arrow does not follow the laws of gravity. It goes straight ahead, whereas, as you can see, the Unholy Arrows do follow the curve of gravity. Ah! There we go. A little bit of learning for you guys, if you didn't already know that. I certainly didn't already know that, so, you know, that's pretty cool. <laughs> I learn things even today. Good lord. <laughs> uh, hello. Hi. You are making a mess of my bloomin' land, dude. I want you to pay the price. The price, of course, is death. Wow, look at you. You just, you just went flying, brother. <laughs> Why am I even saying brother so much? That's not a good thing. Hello. Boom. You ain't my brothers anyway. You're like some weird snowmen. Are you the result of some child's wish or something? Oi! Hello. <laughs> they do 33 damage against me. 
It's still a pretty hefty man. Hello, Stabby. <laughs> I love Stabby. Look at him. He can't even stay with me because he's blooming bouncing around all the time. What a bunch of idiots. You guys done yet? Huh? You done? Hello. Hi. Hi. They are dropping presents as well, so we could possibly do it again. Although, to be <laughs> I see no need to do this event really because all you get from it is snow blocks. Unless you're in the seasonal sort of time of the year, in which case you do get presents from it as well. But uh, outside of that, you literally only get snow blocks. So that's a thing. I don't even know if you can get blooming key molds from these dudes. Hey! Gotta love the old shotgun. Thank you, buddy. Thank you. Why am I using... <laughs> I don't even know. Don't even know. So this thing does a pretty nice amount of damage per second, doesn't it? Hello. Hi. Hi, look at you lot bouncing around. Look at you. Are you... You don't have legs, do you? Oh, what a shame. Evolution has not allowed you to have legs. See, look, the Terraria devs hate snowmen. That, that's what's going on here, ladies and gentlemen. The Terraria devs are not a fan of snowmen, so they don't give them legs. So, yeah. Wow, look at all the presents, though. Sure is a lot. Awesome. Let's keep it going, I guess. <laughs> you guys dead yet? How about now? Oh, that was easy. Huh. The entire thing is being defeated. Well, it was almost worth not making a two-parter. Hmm. Okay. Okay, maybe this can be a whole episode, I guess. I honestly thought this invasion would take a lot longer than it did. But it did not. So, yeah. That's the thing. Anyways, guys, I think on that note, it is time to end the episode. Thank you very much for watching, guys. If you did enjoy the episode and, of course, you're excited to see more, be sure to hit that thumbs up button. And, of course, you can subscribe if you want to know when the future videos are out. To leave us off, let's have a look what's in these presents. Pine tree blocks, candy cane, musket... What the hell? Ooh! Ah, oh, it's basically a musket. Okay, what's that? Candy cane blocks, holly. Ooh! Oh, my God, we totally got to make our house a little bit more festive. Here we go. Can this go bang in the middle? Yay! Oh, this is so cool. <laughs> what else have we got? Another holly! Okay, we're going to put it right here. There we go. And what have we got this time? Pine tree blocks. Oh, man. There we go, my friends. The seasonal update or seasonal event is now here as of the 15th of December 2014. So, yeah, I believe it runs until the 1st of January as well. So, if you want to get your presents, then now is the time to play Terraria, my friends. But, yes, that will wrap it up for today's episode. Thank you very much for watching, and I appreciate you guys' continued support. And I will see you guys in the next episode.